Um, after we take a look at this, we will uh, bring us back to the questions and comments, and uh, we'll continue to uh, provide you coverage. But uh, right now is something that happens only periodically, the International Space Station providing one of the best views possible of the hurricane, and I, th I feel that this is something that we should bring to you live as it occurs. And that may well be the edge of the storm. Okay, it's definitely Yeah. I'm going to be changing the devices of the back shortly. Okay. Struggling to see any uh, <laughs> land areas to give ourselves a geographical perspective here, but uh, I'm sure we'll see something at some point. But yes, this is the International Space Station which circles the Earth. Uh, it makes a full transit of the Earth in space uh, every 90 minutes or so. And it's provided wonderful pictures of storms in the past since it launched in, I think it was 2000 or 2001. It's the International Space Station, I believe, is still the most expensive object in the world, even though it's not even in the world. According to Middlehead Rob, it's currently moving northeast over the Atlantic, which is from Comet. That appears to be it. I wonder whether we'll be able to discern right, the, back. And whether we'll be able to clearly make out the eye. Quite uh, um, disorientating watching it as if we're upside down. But here we are, the camera's panning. And zoom in would be nice. <laughs> we don't control the camera. Okay. Um, the astronauts are currently in the Caribbean Sea. They are hmm. close to Jamaica. They're moving at a rapid pace. Oh yeah, they do. They pet. They, they moved over Ni Nicaragua. I don't know how to pronounce that. Sorry, a couple seconds ago. And they're getting close to Jamaica, so you could see the storm in a couple couple seconds or so. Oh, we've already got it here. It's just right there. Oh wow! Yeah. Preferred the other camera. <laughs> so we're just bringing to you the footage from NASA TV right now from their several cameras that they have on top of the International Space Station at this hour. And at the end of this hour, we will bring to you the National Hurricane Center's update on the storm because they are expected to be uh, coming out with their update. Ah, there it is. That's probably going to be our best view of the storm here. And the eye, not particularly clear, but it's quite something. And that's my phone. So there's the passage of the storm, of the uh, International Space Station rather, passing over the storm. It's bird's eye view. It's a pretty high bird. Terrific view. If you've just joined us, Matthew is a 120 mile per hour hurricane and could be intensifying. There is the eye wall, the centre part of the storm. The eye is somewhere underneath those clouds. 
and you'll be seeing hurricane force winds in there and some of it is over the Bahamas right now. That is Hurricane Matthew. And now they've flown directly over it now and they're moving away to the other side off towards the open Atlantic. You might be able to make out some of the islands of the Bahamas here if you're lucky. It's one of the most impressive kinds of viewing that you can get of tropical storms and hurricanes. In real time, no less. So that is live right now, what the storm looks like, and you can see its influence, its outer bands extending some distance away from the center of the storm. There's another view. And uh, guys, at this point, uh, is there anything you'd like to say? I've just enjoyed the perfect view from the space and station. Just, the view. Well, sorry, from last year. And uh, I don't suppose Craig, uh, Recon must be close to it now as well. He was talking about how Recon were heading towards the plane, the Reconnaissance planes. And they'll be going inside the storm. Probably getting an even better view than we just got. So there it is, fading off into the distance from the International Space Station. And some people saying things like, oh, it's an eighth the size of the world. No, I wouldn't say that. It's somewhat misleading. Um, oh, there's another shot. That's, that's one of my favourites. I'm just struggling to see if we can see any land areas there and can't see any on the uh, on the water. That's all ocean. As always. As always, uh, over a hurricane last year. 